Hello and welcome back to Telespec's Garage. Today we are going to demonstrate how easy and simple it is to install a new Valcom PA system in your warehouse, your shop, or in your school. If you don't know who I am, my name is Nova Giragos. I have personally migrated thousands of businesses to Telespecs, which is America's number one business phone system. My contact information is listed below. Please feel free to call me anytime with your questions. Why you would need a PA system in your business? Because the phones already have a built-in PA where you can uh, do intercom uh, with another phone or you can do a public announcement directly on the phones. Uh, a PA system would really be necessary if you have a shop or you have a school that needs to play a bell schedule or you have a warehouse where the phones are just not loud enough and uh, you need to be able to hear when the phones are ringing. So all of these uh, features can be programmed into the uh, PA controller box which you would get from Telespecs and that controller box is what connects to the speaker and allows you to to hear the announcements and such. So that controller box is absolutely necessary. You must have a controller box in order for the PA system to work. The other thing I wanted to cover is that it doesn't matter what kind of a uh, PA system you may already have. You can integrate Telespecs uh, with your existing PA system. Again, you would need the controller box and it doesn't matter uh, what kind of a connector uh, your current PA system takes for audio. We have adapters that will work with any kind of uh, a PA system. It comes from our controller box. The PA controller box comes out and the audio connection can fit into any kind of a system that you have currently, including uh, these kinds of, uh, this is a Valcom amplifier that takes the screw on connection. So it doesn't matter what kind of a system you already have, you can integrate Telespecs into your business warehouse. And if you don't have a PA system, you can pick up one of these for really cheap. The horn and the power adapter is about $100. And then you would need some kind of an extension to mount this speaker up high in the ceiling or somewhere that's out of the reach because it is very loud. That cable is about 16 to $20 for a hundred feet. So it's very inexpensive and running that cable is going to be the most difficult part of this uh, project here. Okay. So let's get started. Uh, as I mentioned in the beginning, this is really, really easy to set up the uh, PA system. I have my little notes here. Uh, so I don't forget anything. Excuse me if you see my paper here, but I am uh, kind of glancing at it as I speak here. All you got to do is really connect the audio cable and the power cable. There are two audio cables and two power cables and the power cables are the white and the black. The audio cables are the red and the green. And so you would just extend that out uh, with the extension uh, cabling that you have. And then on this end here, the uh, black cable again, coming from the horn, there's a black cable in here and I've kind of matched it up with the black cable that's inside over here. That is the positive uh, of the um, power adapter. And the white is the negative. So the, the black and the white go to your power adapter. Please make sure that you connect the black to the positive the white to the negative, and then the audio cables, which are the green and the red over here. On this end, it really doesn't matter what colors uh, you connect them to. The, um, the PA controller that we have and provide to you doesn't care about the red and the green or which way you, you know, switch these around. It doesn't matter. So you just have four cables connecting to the speaker. You have the power going to it, and then you have the audio going to it. It has a built-in amplifier on it and a volume control that you can adjust later to your desired uh, volume. So that's really easy to set up. You can go to our website and you can download this diagram right here. If you already have an amp, you would connect the Telespecs controller box with the provided cable. We need to know what kind of amp you have so we can get you the right cable. But all you have to do is just connect this cable to your amp and the amp is already connected to your speakers. This is for an existing setup uh, if you already have one. If you don't have an existing setup, here it is. There's your power adapter. There are your cables, the black and the white. And it says that the black is the positive, the red, the white is the negative, And that goes to your speaker. And then the green and the red cables are the audio cables and they come in and plug into your uh, PA controller that you get from Telespec. So the diagrams are already there. You can go there right now and download this diagram. So you know exactly what you need to get. Also the model numbers of this uh, Valcom 
uh, speaker and the power adapter and the cable that you're going to need to run, which is a four conductor cable. Those are listed on the website. You can pick this up on Amazon if you want. Again, I want to mention that Telespecs doesn't make any money on the products that we sell. You can buy them from Amazon or eBay, wherever you like. And all we do is provide the service for this. So we want you to get the best deal. The last uh, thing I wanted to mention to you is specific to schools, but also you can use this feature um, with warehouses and shops if you want. You can actually call from your cell phone directly into the speaker. So you don't have to run to a Telespecs phone to make an announcement. You can call from right here from your cell phone and I will demonstrate that to you. Call. I'm getting feedback there because the cell phone is so close to the speaker. That was a demonstration of how that works with the cell phone calling in directly to the speaker. It's really important in schools if there is an emergency and a staff member that's out on the, in the yard and they see something and they need to make an announcement, call a code red. They can just use their cell phone, get on the PA system and make the announcement so everybody's safe as quickly as possible. So that concludes our demonstration of how to set up a new PA system or to connect to an existing PA system. Again, if you have any questions, please give me a call. My contact information is below. Thank you for watching and have a great day.